Hello and welcome to another video tutorial brought to you by Octotuts.com. Today we're going to be making a very very simple starburst effect using Adobe Photoshop. This literally involves like two steps. So let's get started right away. Let's click on File New. And I'm going to make a new image with a width of 1000 pixels and a height of 1000 pixels. You can make it any size that you want. Press OK. The first thing that we need to do is add a gradient. So choose the gradient tool. It might be hidden behind the paint bucket tool. If it is, just click and drag, choose a gradient tool. Make sure your foreground and background color are set to black and white. Click at the bottom, hold shift, and drag it all the way to the top and let go. And you should have a gradient that looks like that. Next, click on filter, distort, and click on wave. You want everything to be the same, but the type to be square and press OK. And you should get this. And then next, let's click on filter again. And let's hover over distort again. And let's click on polar coordinates. And the default should be rectangular to polar. So keep that checked and press OK. And bam, we have a really, really cool starburst effect. Now, if you double click on the background layer to unlock it and press OK, what you could do is change the blend mode of this to screen. So anytime you put something under it, the black will go away and all you will see is the, um, is the effect, the starburst effect. So let me make a new layer so I can show you guys really quick. Let me put a colored background. Let's put red. As you can see, the black disappears and you only see the white starburst effect. So that's it for this video tutorial. This is Octotoots.com and until next time, I will see you guys later.